Hello, you divine infinite human being to all that is, ever, has been, and ever, ever, ever shall be. And a voice out of the darkness. <laughs> I want to give you some really important ascension information that I hope will ease this beautiful journey that you're on of ascension. I know it's difficult at times, but remember, you've only been waiting for this for 250 million years. All right, so it's the most important thing. Yes, it might get in the way of other stuff, but hey, you're only bringing up a carbon downgraded, animalistic kind of body into a refined, divine, crystalla light body. All right, that's all. And of course, it's going to take its toll. So sometimes you're going to feel really, really tired. I know I felt that um, because the energies are so intense that it's just wearing your body down. But rest, rest, rest. This is more important than your job. This is more important than your family. This is more important than your relationship. This is the most important thing you have to do ever, ever, ever. Okay, so make time for it. Many of us have found ourselves alone and, and, and unemployed or, or in different job situations because of the pandemic, which was actually helping you to be able to nurture yourself, to tune into your body, to know what it needs moment to moment. So uh, you may need to change your diet. You may, And I've talked about this in another video. You may need to eat more carbs or more meat if you don't. Uh, some, some days and some days you might be able to go on just uh, like I do sometimes uh, papaya juice and, 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 and coconut water. I mean, just be a fruitarian. Going to the dogs so uh pay attention um i have been very dizzy and i know i've talked to you guys or you sent me messages saying there's been so much dizziness well we're only in a whole new harmonic universe so our body has to acclimate to com completely coming out of reverse polarities in a fallen universe literally so of course we're going to be uh you know reacclimating ourselves and we're going to have vertigo all right so please be aware of this don't you know modern medicine will tell you you're sick there's something wrong with you you need to stop it you need to oh gracias you need to um take some kind of medicine or something but that's just gonna halt the process or or do worse so you don't want to do that you want to rebalance because if you're really really getting a lot of energy you're not sleeping you're dizzy you know you're just um exhausted because you, you've got so much energy then you need to ground yourself I talked to someone today because I've been wearing all this. This is Sunchai, Amber. Um, dark, I'm wearing a lot more um, earthy colors because they help ground me. I'm always barefoot, you know, walking in the sand, walking in the beach. I'm barefoot right now. I'm outside. I'm lucky because, you know, I'm in, in a tropical climate. So I know it's really hard, especially in the winter, if you're in the northern North Europe or, or, or North America, it's hard to walk barefoot outside, <laughs> you know, it's freezing and you're isolated. You're in a lot of times hermetically sealed you know environments but do your best to get out there breathe fresh air touch the soil uh ground yourself and of course crystals but but the the the, the lower spectrum of crystals you know the reds the darks the browns the grounding crystals the the uh, sunshine the tourmaline the um amber you know the citron the jaspers those are the grounding ones i actually sleep with them i have copper balls that i hold on to and i have to sleep with them and hold them to my head a lot of times just to stop spinning <laughs> i know it sounds crazy but many of you can identify with what i'm saying so ascension symptoms are off the chart but it's all good because it's upgrading your body and you're getting heaping helping doses now i mean that the, the the ascension energy the high vibes are off the chart and they're only going to continue that's the good news <laughs> Okay, the bad news. The good news is that you are going to acclimate to them. You will. It's just going to take time, and that's worth learning how to do. Okay, it's worth studying. It's worth becoming 
Sí, sí, no, 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 es muy dulce. Kiki's getting petted. <laughs> so I'm in an Italian restaurant here in Mexico, so it's so great. So um, that's important. And then, of course, your shadow self is coming up, which is good. I talked about this because you have to realize you, the things that are coming up now have been lifetimes upon lifetimes upon lifetimes. You've just been in Groundhog Day repeating the same thing over and over again and dying, forgetting, and going back and doing the same karmic pattern. So now you're getting a chance to finish that same bad relationship you've been in in a in an artificial time loop for millions upon millions of years. That same un, uh, victimizing mentality you've been doing forever. That same, uh, you know, uh, cord, cords, you know, not, not cutting the cords and not freeing yourself up and not putting yourself first and not feeling worthy and not, uh, you know, being abundant and not using your p own power. <sighs> It's all ending now, but you have to end it, okay? So if I can explain it to you, you've been like this bubble in a toilet, <laughs> okay? That's the only way. In a lower harmonic universe with the decks stacked against you. So you, many of us have been the lone voice in the crowd, the lone voice of justice, the lone sense of, of, of ethnic, I mean ethnic, ethnic, yeah, ethic and ethics and and justice and and um you know a sense of moral consciousness perhaps we've been the only ones to speak and we've been reprimanded we've been the the black sheeps of the family we've been the lone people in the crowd you know we've been bullied we've been um you know just burned stoned tortured you know raped uh, especially the divine feminine we've been suppressed we've been smooshed down stomped on tipped, uh, you name it that's been our history so we have to oh, we have to overcome that we have to heal the trauma and we have to realize things are going to be different this time we are no longer in the toilet where the deck is stacked against us we're not playing poker with a loaded deck, you know, because every time we would be the losers. We are the winners, okay? You are a winner now. You do not have to play victim. The only victimization that exists now is in your mind. It's the reflection. It's the MK Ultra mind control that makes you believe because it has happened so much. I understand it's history, but history is not going to repeat itself. You have to get out of this time loop. And the brain is what keeps you in it. So you have to let your heart lead. You have to let your intuition. You have to go from the gut, all those sayings. You have to go from your hunches. You have to wing it with your plasma wings, angelic wings. You're gonna have to step out of the old way, the finite way, the fallen earth way of doing things and have the faith and have the courage and have the, um, the gumption to step out and do it different. And you're gonna to have to do it different every time now until different becomes your way of doing it. But when you do, oh my God, you're gonna fly with your plasma angelic wings. You're going to experience abundance. You're gonna find your tribe and feel so connected, not only with other people, but to source and to your your star families, to your true angelic, and I and I don't like to, I never used angels. Oh, the angels told me because most of them were fallen angels telling me what to do. So now you are the angel, okay? You're the angel, so you're going to find your family who are angelic beings, and they're going to be supporting you, helping you. I mean, the guidance, the help you're getting is off the charts. Just accept it, okay? Those little tiny hunches. Oh, sh I should bring my umbrella. Follow them now. You can't not follow them because they're huge. Oh yes, let me play those lottery numbers. Oh yes, let me quit this job. Uh, oh yes, let me call that person. Oh yes, let me turn right at this corner. Okay, oh yes, let me take that trip or go to that restaurant or stop in that store or, you know, those are little things, but the synchronicity, and if anyone's seen the movie Serendipity, I love that movie. 
the serendipitous synchronicity is off the charts now. So that's where you're going to be finding your next job, finding your next partner, finding your next friend, finding your next mission, finding your next home, finding your next through that, that those serendipitous synchronicity. There is no coincidence type of encounters. Okay. I hope this helps you. Love you guys. And please, uh, I wrote my book, The Infinite Human. It's full of these pearls, these gems, this inspiration to just remind you how divinely infinite and powerful you are. So it's The Infinite Human. It's in Italian. It's in Spanish now. It's all around the world and it's creating a new consciousness renaissance. And you can find it um, on Amazon or on my website, www.infinitehuman.com and join up my newsletter and uh, there's all kinds of free blogs and everything so it's all about information not about making money ciao for now